in this video, we will be talking about the mole concept. You will learn how to convert mass to mole or mole to mass in three easy steps. First, always start with a given, identify the given, then calculate the molar mass. Third, convert mass to mole or mole to mass. Are you ready? Get your periodic table in scientific calculator. This is our roadmap on how to get the correct answer. Again, always start with the given. Then, get the molar mass and the conversion factor between one mole of a substance and the molar mass. After that, we can now cancel out grams remaining mole as to answer our question or the problem. So let's have an example. Convert 18 grams of water to moles of water. First step, write the given. And our given is 18 grams of water. Then, get the molar mass. Don't know how to get the molar mass? Kindly visit this video. You may click the link below. Let us now continue. The molar mass of water is 18 grams of water. Take note, if the given is in grams, the molar mass should be written below or as a denominator. Then the third step, the conversion between mole and mass. To do that, just always write at the top or as a numerator the 1 mole of water. Then we can now cancel out grams of water, remaining the mole of water as to answer the question or the problem. Now get your scientific calculator in solve. 18 times 1 divided by 18 is equal to 18 moles of water. Therefore, 18 grams of water is equal to 18 moles of water. Next problem. If you have 34.5 grams of sodium chloride, how many moles of sodium chloride do you have? First step, write the given. And our given is 34.5 grams of NaCl. Right after, get the molar mass. And the molar mass of NaCl is 58.4 grams. How did we get that? Kindly visit this video. And for our mass to mole conversion, just write 1 mole of NaCl. That is 1 mole of NaCl is 258.0 grams of NaCl. Then we can cancel out now grams of NaCl. Remaining the unit mole of NaCl as to answer the problem. So let's calculate 34.5 grams of NaCl times 1 mole of NaCl divided by 58.4 grams of NaCl is equal to 0 0.59 mole of NaCl. How many moles of NaCl do you have if you have 34.5 grams of NaCl? The answer is 0 0.59 mole of NaCl. Next problem we have. What is the mass of 3.987 mole of aluminum? As you can observe, the question now here is for mass. The given is in mole. To start, write first the given which is 3.987 mole of aluminum and for our second step instead of getting the molar mass we're going to get the atomic mass or atomic weight because aluminum is an element or an atom not a compound the atomic weight of aluminum is 26.98 grams then for our conversion between mass to mole we have 1 mole of aluminum is to 26.98 grams of aluminum. Take note that 1 mole of aluminum is written below or as a denominator because the given is in mole. 
Y for us to cancel out mole of aluminum, remaining grams of aluminum as to answer the problem. Then let's compute 3.987 times 26.98 divided by 1 is equals to 107.6 grams of aluminum. So what is the mass of 3.987 mole of aluminum? That is 107.6 grams of aluminum. Let us now proceed with our next problem we have. Calculate the mass of 3 moles of calcium chloride. The given is 3 moles of calcium chloride. Next step. The molar mass of calcium chloride is 110.98 grams of calcium chloride. Then our conversion factor for mass to mole is 1 mole of calcium chloride is to 110.98 grams of calcium chloride. Now let's cancel out mole of calcium chloride remaining grams of calcium chloride to answer the question. So let's compute 3 times 110.98 grams calcium chloride divided by 1 is equals to 333 grams of calcium chloride. Therefore, the mass of 3 moles of calcium chloride is 333 grams of calcium chloride.